Today, let's talk about patience while reefing. Yes, what's happening and welcome back to the channel. So today people, I just like to talk about being patient while reefing. So when I got my first reef tank about six years ago, I was so, so um, impatient and I just wanted to get some fish in there, put my rock, make it into this amazing aquascape, get some coral in there and then have an amazing reef tank. But I was way, way um, behind the knowledge curve when it came to reefing. So. I had to take a step back, read about cycling an aquarium where you add um, bits of bacteria in there and allow it to take a couple of weeks. In my case, it took about seven to eight weeks for my tank to cycle just because I just wasn't adding enough bacteria. Um, I'd done massive water changes when I shouldn't. So it was a case of me reading and doing research in how a reef tank is supposed to be cycled for you to put some fish in there. So guys, you cannot rush nature. Allow your tank to go through its ugly stage, hair algae, and test your water to see when your nitrates are rising, to you know your tank's done. Also educate yourself about salinity, temperature, magnesium, uh, alkalinity, calcium, and even nitrates and phosphates, and what kinds of bacteria use up these nitrates and phosphates to keep your system balanced. Because the more knowledge you have in this, in this hobby, the better equipped you are to deal with issues when they arise as you get further along. For example, if you are dealing with an issue where they have cyano on your sand bed, then you probably know there's an imbalance somewhere, it might be flow. So the more knowledge you have and the more patience you have while doing this hobby, the better it will be for you in the long run. Also, be patient when adding coral to your system. If you add a coral and the system cannot support the coral, you will just end up wasting your money and the coral might just die. Don't be an idiot like me. If you feel that your system is ready for coral and you're not too sure, take your water down to your local fish shop, have them test the water for you. And if it's not, just be patient. Then a couple of weeks later, take it down again, have them test it and start slow. Maybe with a softy, then work your way up to SPS when you feel you are ready. So this is Narayan from Narayan's Reef. Thanks for watching guys. See you soon.